What's up everybody? Welcome back to Make More. My name is Casper. So today we have a video about the Einscan Pro 2X Plus. It is a three part video. The first off will be an unboxing of the scanner. The second video will be an unboxing of the industrial package for the scanner. And part three will be me and you using the scanner and see what can we actually scan with it. What's up everybody? Welcome back to Make More. My name is Casper. So this is a little bit different because I need the camera on the scanner over there and I need a camera on my computer and I need to record what the computer sees and what the camera sees. So I have been trying to scan different things all day long now. You can see on the top here the calibration time was yeah but now it's nine o'clock and it's uh, dark outside. I think we should look at how to scan something, just scan some random stuff and, and things and yeah, such as stuff, yeah. And maybe we need to uh, add your house or something like that, or you're a designer or something, and you have designed some awesome handle for a special door or something like that. I have uh, a, a very old house and the handles I, I can't get anymore uh, I don't know why but I can I cannot get, get a handle anymore so we're gonna do a fix scan because we got the industrial package over there I'm gonna place this one over there and sorry if uh, if the scan is gonna be a little bit weird but I have tried it out before I have a lot of light over there, so you guys better can see stuff. So we're gonna start a new project. And no, not stone, because I have tried to make stone. Scan. And a lot of tests. Let's make a new handle. Does already exist. Probably apply. And in the top corner up here, you can see what we are about to scan. This is the turntable. I've set the turntable to take five revolutions because it's a handle. It doesn't need that much detail because why? But let's say you uh, it's it has to be a perfect handle. So let's start it up. First of all, it's gonna verify. The verification is it's gonna take four or five steps to see if the alignment is correct or it can see enough of the print. So now we just need to wait to see that. Yeah. Oh yeah, and uh, when I'm just looking at this, oh, and it's scanning, wow. Damn, that's, uh, that's super beautiful. And it's so fast. Oh my god, God. I need to scan everything. Oh, it's so damn fast. Okay, so there's a little bit of a problem in this door handle. Um, the printer needs, or the printer, the scanner needs some something it can see uh, that's gonna make it out. You know, when you see your hand, you know it's the left one. I'm probably getting this wrong, but you know it's the left one because your thumb and stuff like that. But the scanner needs the same thing, and we need to remove some stuff, and we need to remove some more stuff. I'm just holding down shift to removing stuff, and under here, and that's it. That's a pretty dang good handle. I'm gonna apply. I'm going over again, flip it over to the other side, you can see it up here again, and we're gonna scan it again. Uh, I have tried to scan uh, this little thingy bub up. I have scanned a stone, because this is my favorite stone, it's Steve, Steve the stone. I really love Steve, Steve is a good friend of mine, and uh, I got him from Kim, and Kim if you're watching, thank you for Steve. Pyramid is a little bit of a weird one. Where does I? 
it's, it's a little bit of a weird one, but I have been on vacation in Egypt. Uh, I have been swimming with fishes and stuff like that. So it was, it was fun and sharks, but I didn't get eaten because it tastes like shit. And we need to remove the rest of the scam. Oh, yep. And I touched it a little bit, but it doesn't matter because we're gonna fix it later. So let's fix the rest of it up. Remove that. Remove that. And remove that. Okay, so now we got the door handle and we're gonna accept it. And it's probably gonna show up some weird stuff. Yeah, like that. But the alignment tool down here, you can zoom in, but you need to you need to do it, you know. When it's it's upside down, you need to turn it around and stuff like that so you can see it. And align it, align it, hold down shift, place. And it was not okay. We're gonna try to click the same place up here. We're gonna click in there, in there, and we're gonna try one in the front. And it's not perfectly every time, but you need to practice a little. I will, I will call that almost perfect the first time. Okay, that's a little bit bright here, but we can fix that. So we're gonna remove it. And we got the door handle. And small concaves and insides and stuff like that, it's hard to get. But anyway, who is gonna get the inside of this anyway? You can just make a square put it inside and subtract it and stuff like that so yeah you guys know how to fix it okay so now it's done we're going to the model uh, do you want to save the changes yes i want to save the changes mesh watertight highly and this can take a couple of minutes to do oh yeah did i forget to tell you to subscribe to my channel and it's done so Let's talk about this one. It's a little bit weird. I, I would like a preview of this before I just accept anything. Um, I have the, been using the Einscan Pro for quite a long time. And it has this feature where you can smooth and you can sharpen. But there's no preview. So you never know what it's gonna do to the model. I, I, if you are making uh, like a bust or something like that, or you are taking a scan of a sculpture, I would recommend to use the smooth and sharpen at the same time. If you're gonna make something that's need to be like, you, you know, you need it to be precise, it has to hold this thing. Uh, I will use the, sh the sharpen and not the smooth. And if you're just making you know, silly stuff, you make a rock and you want to make a hole for it, maybe just a smooth. But for this video, let's make it the sharp. Let it process. Go, go Power Rangers. And it's done. So, as you can see, I got a perfect. Let me just get this one over here. I got a perfect replica. Oh, it's so freaking awesome. Okay, I, I, I need to do more stuff. I, wow, just wow. Yeah, the, the holes and stuff like that. If you got a deep hole like this, I will recommend just making a model and subtract it. it. It's much easier and it's more precise. And small holes like that, you already got the, the indentation and everything. So you can just drop in a pillow or something like that and subtract. So this is a model that is not good for scanning on a uh, scanner, 3D scanner. And it's because it's quite bright. And when the, um, the, the light hits it, it is, it's gonna be like, uh, you know, when you take a flashlight and, and light outside, it, the light also came in. But if you want to, you can buy something called a 3D scan spray. And 3D scan spray is a little bit like if, if you take like um, baking powder or something like that, put inside a pressure uh, holder and spray it out. 
it's it's a little bit like that, but just just meant to do what it has to do. You know what I mean. But the model is it, it's this one. Uh, I wanted to make a holder for it, but it's quite hard to get all the details and stuff like. I can spray it with this, but I need to use this afterwards. So if you're gonna use scan spray, please look out for like electronics and stuff you need to use afterwards because who wants the electronics to burn down when you're using it oh here's my here's my pet rock here's steve oh steve you are fucking weird there we go there we go so this is steve and i got a perfect model of steve this is uh, my model of a pyramid um it's super detailed i could do a better job of scanning it using scan spray again uh, hashtag not sponsored because this stuff is german and I, i'm not german if you know what country i'm from leave it down below. this is uh this is my pyramid i uh, i took it home from egypt don't worry i left the big model in egypt Funny guy, and you can scan it in different ways. So uh, I um, I use the the platform to scan everything. If you wanted to, uh, you know, like uh, you have everything, but you you're missing uh, like this piece right here, you can turn off the turntable, and you can just place your model up here uh, on the turntable over there, and you can just place it with the the part that's missing, and you can scan it, and you can just uh, cut it out, and it will place it in. But if it don't have like any uh, any points of uh, of interest or something like that, or what you're gonna call it, like uh, these three figurines, they are not the same. So the model will know how to put it together because it's not the same model all over the place, and the stones are different and stuff like that. But the bottom is flat, so it has no place to like put it in. So you need to put some pointers on it or something like that to um, to make it work perfectly. I've been using the Pro, the normal Pro, for a long time, and this is the Pro 2X Plus. Uh, the issue with the Pro when you are going around and scanning and stuff like that, it uh, it's losing track uh, every time, all the time, and it's hard to get back. This one is so much better. When you're going around and you're trying to uh, track, and you lose the track, uh, when you have the Pro, it's just like shit, yeah, I can't do this anymore. But the new Pro 2X Plus, you just hold it still over a place where you have been scanning. And it's magically just gonna know where it is again. And you can do it again. And you can do it super fast. Uh, like, you know, like this, I'm, I'm not kidding. This is fast. The old model, you have to... It's like super, super slow, but the new one you can just go around. It's like painting with uh, aerosol cans, you know, spray cans and stuff like that. So it's super, super good. So I I think it's 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 pretty much, it's yeah, it's pretty much just it. If you're interested where, where I'm getting my stuff from, you can uh, see the links down below. If you're new here, consider subscribing. It help, It's helping me out a bunch and I'm super glad for every subscriber I get and more and more subscribers means I can test out more and more products so please subscribe to the channel if you like what I'm doing if you don't like what I'm doing just watch the videos I like to make them hashtag not sponsored <laughs> hashtag not paid either so I'm pretty uh, pretty dang uh, excited to do new videos so I just hope you like this one. It's a, it's a little bit longer video, but yeah, you have to live with it. If you're gonna pay like 60 grand for a scanner, you're gonna watch a video. There's, how long is this video? Oh, it's 22 minutes now. Oh, but you're not gonna see 22 minutes, don't worry. I'm gonna shorten it down. But this is the end for me. I hope you liked it. And as always, stay awesome. Peace, boy.
you know, when you are using OBS to record and you're using your cam over there to record, but it's not recording anymore, so it's just dumb. I didn't take it to record me, and yeah, you know, 